on Tereo Perni day 30 it's time for a change of the fodder plant because um, not only they um, look a little bit dried out here in the aerarium but also outside in the forest now it's really difficult to find uh, nice and fresh leaves but as you can see here we have uh, Ontario Perni caterpillars just on the top here of this twig so I carefully try to present it to you here so now they are pretty big this is already an L5 and here's another one but as we have already seen in the last video they are very very good in mimicry so you don't see them they quite they look quite like a piece of a leaf or a piece of the of the acorn of the top of the head of the acorn here yes this is the the shape of the acorn and if you look at the head capsule sometimes it looks well uh, it's a bit covered here so we don't see it but you know the size now here is around five centimeters but they can now grow even bigger and now let's see what we will find in some uh, more days when we present them some new fresh leaves this one they don't look so bad now but I think that I will put this back into the aerarium and here you see the big L5 fecal pellets. Now let's move them a little bit so that I can show it to you the size of them. These are the fecal pellets here of the L5 caterpillars of the big ones. So that now they are around uh, 5 millimeters long and are also around 5 millimeters wide. So what I have to do, I already have. Um, presented some new foods here but first I have to take the whole thing out and and see where the caterpillars are so now I went through all of my twigs of oak and I found all six caterpillars so that's nice we uh, haven't lost one and also what you can see here this is also very special um, on a twig, on a twig here you can see the the skin of the L4 caterpillar here still on the twig of the oak and the new L5 caterpillar came out here and is now uh, on their way like this here, big one a little covered under the leaves of this oak pretty big now but they can still grow this is around six centimeters long but they can still get uh, bigger so I have to bring some new of these oak trees that I have prepared here into my aerarium and I hope that they can be even bigger than now and that we have a nice Ontario Perni um, making a cocoon soon, around, I should say around 10 days to 2 weeks we should see them uh, preparing their hibernation by building a cocoon that will overwinter and in next year then around May Hopefully they come out and we have a new generation of Ontario Perni. So stay tuned to this channel. You will see in every around four days a new video in your language or if you go to the playlist you can also see that there is another uh, logbook going on in German. Thanks for watching.